I am creating this video after a long research of my whole day. So sit back and in just 3 to 5 minutes, you will get what is promised in the title of this video. So if you want to recover your Gmail account, there may be one of the multiple reasons. The first reason is you have just forgot your email address or you have just forgot your password. And the second reason may be someone has hacked your Gmail account and now you want to recover it. In both the cases, you will get your answer. So I'm just creating this video on my laptop, but the process is exactly the same on both of the devices, whether you are doing it on your laptop or your mobile phone. So first of all, you have to go to the Google's sign-in page. You can go to mail.google.com or accounts.google.com. And after that, this interface will appear up. Now in the first case, let's consider that you have forgot your email address. So first let's see that how you can recover your email address. For that purpose, you have to click on this forgot email button. It will ask you for your name, phone number or email. Now it's obvious that we have forgot our email. So you have to enter the phone number which is associated with your email address. So enter your phone number and press the next button. It will ask you for your account's name. My Google's account name was Abdul was the first name and Ghani was the second name. Just write first name in the first box and last name in the second box and press the next button. It will ask you to send a verification code on your phone number. Press the send button. Just write here the code that you receive on your phone number and press the next button and it will provide you the email address. Now as I already know my email address, so let me go to my main page. So enter your email address and press the next button. And now let's consider that you have forgot your password or your account has been hacked and the hacker has changed your password. In both of the cases, you have to click on this forgot password button. So enter your phone number and press the next button. And if you have your two step verification turned on, it will send you a notification on your Gmail app. You have to click on that and you will be signed into your Gmail account. But let's consider that we don't have access to this. So click on try another way. Now, if you have lost access to your phone number or the hacker has changed the phone number, which was associated with your Google account. And when you click on try another way, instead of writing your phone number or instead of writing the code, which was sent to your phone number, this prompt will be shown to you, which is enter one of your eight digit backup codes. Now these backup codes work if you had set them when you had access to your Gmail account. These are a kind of security codes which help you recover your Google account. For example, I have entered one of my security code and press the next button. Oh, I have already used it. You can only use one backup code once. So let me enter another code and press the next button. Now this is the next page. If you don't have access to your phone number, you have to enter a backup code. If you don't have access to your backup codes, then you have to have access to any of your email address. The first one is my own email address, which is I'm trying to recover. And the second one is my recovery email address, which I had entered at the time when I had access to my Gmail account. That's why I've created a previous video in which I've educated that how you can secure your Gmail account. And in that video, I have told the method to add a recovery email address which help when you lose access to your Gmail account. So as soon as you click that, a code will be sent to that email address and you have to enter that code here and press the next button and you will be able to access your Google account. But let's consider that you also don't have access to any of your recovery email address or the hacker has changed it or you have just not added the recovery email address. So if I click on try another way, it again redirects me to the same page where it asks me to get a verification code on any of these email address. But as I don't have access to any of these, so I'm going to click on try another way to sign in. And now it is saying that you didn't provide enough information for Google to be sure this account is really yours. Now this is the hole I'm dropped into since this morning when I had starting researching the method for logging into my account if I don't have access to any of the things that it has asked from me. I don't have access to my phone number, my recovery email address, my backup codes or my password. After the long research of my whole day, I've come to this conclusion that there is no way to contact Google support to hold a manual review of my account for recovering it. The whole process of recovering the Gmail account is completely automated. So you must have access to any of these things which it has asked from me to regain access to your Google account. But if you don't have access to any of these things, you will not be able to recover your Gmail account. 
I'm still trying to find any way to recover the Gmail account without the need of all these things. And as soon as I find one, I will upload a video. But up to the day, I've just got to this conclusion that you need any of these things to recover your account. Now, if somehow you have recovered your Google account from a hacking attempt or you have logged in without your password after a long time, here's a quick video tutorial in the end screen which tells you that how you can now secure your Google account so it won't be hacked anymore. See you in that video there. Thank you so much.